Welcome back. Let's get started. And then what's going to be over here? I guess like I'm relaxing FG. Thanks for joining me for another banished video. There's that sneak peek of what's to come. Last left off with deciding the placement of these houses here. Once I have a nice long row of those to the extent of the circle of influence of the market, I go ahead and place a hospital and a schoolhouse down. Here's a little view of how the town is looking so far. Now that the pastures are complete, I go ahead and split up my animals so that I can grow their population. I start thinking about placing a quarry. I don't really have a big need for stone, but I do want a quarry in place before I grow so much that, oh, I end up needing a quarry and I don't have any place for it. So I get ready to clear a little mountain area and start prepping the homes in the area. I like this setup so much, I'm going to go ahead and put down some stone roads. That area is now prepped, so I will place the quarry down. And as I continue working on this town, I do go and remove resources. Here you get a little look of how those resources are being removed, and you see the hospital and school have their materials placed and ready for building once the builders get to them. I don't want to build too fast. I'd rather have my farmers collect those resources during the winter instead of building during the winter. I'd, I'd grow too fast and then you get your population doesn't have enough food or firewood and then they start dying out. Here I am just flattening more terrain. I want to keep the outskirts of my town clear or be clearing that outskirt area so when I'm ready to build the land is ready for me. Please. Please. <sighs> Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, follow, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Until next time, keep relaxing.